Barcelona is a city of art. It's just teeming with it in, in every aspect. For me, what I connected with is the street art. I went there specifically to try and track down this graffiti artist called Skum, whose work I'd seen a few years back, and in particular this one piece he'd done on Andy Warhol. I was just so taken back by it that I, I really wanted to find him and, and see what he had to say. Walking down the streets in Barcelona, because of the, the incredible artistic nature of the graffiti, it's, it's like walking down a, a live gallery that is constantly growing before you. I just met Nomi randomly on the streets. See, you know, he was just painting. It was really great because he didn't speak any English and I didn't speak any Spanish. We were just communicating through these signs and symbols. Pintando, llevo mucho tiempo, pero graffiti con spray, cuatro años. Antes siempre hacía letras, ¿sabes? Letras, esto así. Y ahora siempre hago muñecos, caracteres, sí. eh, caras, sí, sí. flores, flowers y siempre línea de line, expression y line calligraphic o line expressive, más expresiva. El graffiti de Barcelona es diferente al graffiti de Madrid, es más artístico sí. porque al graffiti viene gente de aquí en Barcelona, de, de fuera del mundo del hip hop y del rap y todo eso. Entonces es más o menos lo mismo en Madrid y aquí es más artístico, más, no sé, es más libre. So you've got your graffiti artists whose life is about painting and then you've got skaters whose life is about skating and they have so much, um, there's so much sort of similarity because it's all about the streets. There's this one great place that everybody hangs at called Manolo. It was a bar for skaters and um, you know, it had a, a movie screen in the back projecting skate bids 24 hours a day. And you know, once the skating stopped at about 12 o'clock at night or whenever, everyone would sort of pile down there and drink cheap wine and have absinthe and get a little crazy. And it was you know, just teeming with life. Fire and all.
So as things do tend to unfold, on the last second of the last minute of the last day in Barcelona, I got my interview with Squim. Barcelona, I'm going to paint graffiti because I can paint where you want, more or less, liberty. There, the police will be respectful, a little less, but in general, I don't know, there are a lot of places to paint, there are a lot of people who paint different styles, but I don't know, I can say that there is a lot of people who live in their own way. There is people who live to paint trains, there is people who live to make their name in all the corners, there is people who have to do murals of 10 meters high, I don't know. There is one who puts their own thing. And I don't know, I don't think that I'm going to be very interested in it. But I don't know. I'm more than happy to spend a lot of time with the people. I'm painting on the street and I'm going to make some work like that. And do you have any any spiritual philosophies on life or any whatever good thing i can do for change the world is change me yeah. and help my people to change you know yeah but i can do anything for the whole world you know i, I have not if each one takes his own responsibilities the world will be better you can just a few people take responsibility for the whole world you know enjoy yourself and your peace Okay, cool.